What's up Gators, I'm Owen. And I'm Nicole. We have a great show today, so let's jump right in. The year is finally coming to an end. District finals are next week. The schedule starts Tuesday and ends Thursday. Tuesday will be periods second and fifth. Wednesday will be first and fourth. And Thursday will be third and sixth period. There will be test makeup days available from today, May 13th, to next Wednesday, May 16th. To find out which day to make up your test, check the papers posted by the front doors in the Commons. Seniors, if you've painted your parking spot, then you must move your car on May 19th by 2 p.m. as the Student Council will be painting over your spot. Man, I'm really behind on my hours. I don't know what to do. Me too. I wonder what we could do. Hey, we heard you guys talking about needing volunteer hours, and we have the perfect opportunity for you. Really? What is it? This Thursday, May 19th, Student Council is looking for volunteers to help repaint the senior parking spots. What do we have to do? First, email Ms. Hiltz and meet in room 409 after school. Okay, what do we need to bring? All you need to bring is a change of clothes and a volunteer hours form, and all other supplies will be provided. Okay, okay. great! great. <laughs> The senior breakfast and grad practice is May 27th. Every senior must attend breakfast and graduation practice. Don't forget that graduation is June 10th. What's up Gators, I'm Nicole and welcome to What's Happening Around the World. To start us off, Ukraine started putting Russian soldiers accused of war crime on trial. These are the first war crime trials of the war. Next, six people were confirmed dead after an explosion at a chemical plant in southeastern Slovenia yesterday. The explosion occurred in the town of Koshevje at the melanin plant which produces chemicals used in paints, rubber, and several other industries. Respire is helping cities breathe by covering walls with moss. It absorbs CO2, filters out pollution, supports wildlife, and it looks pretty good. Dutch concrete walls were covered with the moss to better up their environment. That's all there is for today. Back to the anchors. Ray Spirit Day is coming up. Join us on Saturday, June 4th at 4.10 p.m. at Tropicana Field for the Tampa Bay Rays versus Chicago White Sox. The school that sells the most tickets will get a visit from Raymond and the Rays in the fall. Buy tickets now using the link on screen. If you're interested in joining Color Guard, tryouts are Tuesday, May 17th in the band room. See Mr. Mulder for more information. It's a great way to get involved and stay busy. We're here with star track athlete Aiden Marsh. Aiden, what events do you do? The shot putt and the javelin. And uh, what did you do at the last meet? Well, I got second place in both. I broke the school record at 50 meters for javelin and got a new personal record at 15.7. That's all we got for you guys. What's up, guys? I'm here with Taylor. I run track, do 4x1 long jump, triple jump. But this Friday, I'm going to States for triple jump. Um, at regionals, I placed third with like a 10, 9 meter jump. What's one of the best moments you've had this track season so far? Um, I think PRing with 11.5 uh, meters at triple jump. What's up guys, I'm here with... Evie, I throw discus and shot put. I'm going to see square discus. I threw 31, 41 to qualify for regionals for states. And my favorite time was at conference when I made the senior girl cry because she lost. I'm here with Isaiah Tavo. And Isaiah, what events do you do for track? I throw the discus in the shop. Alright, uh, what have been your like highest stats this year? Uh, so last week at regionals I threw the discus 54 feet, I mean 54 meters. So that's 180 feet. And that was the record, right? Yeah, I set the record. So like record. 5 meters. And then uh, what are you going to uh, stage for? For discus. For no shot put. Discus. Alright. Well, good luck at your meet. The districts, that was my biggest accomplishment. PR like by a lot. So, do you know the exact number? Yeah, by 49. 49. Mm -hmm. All right. And then that from a, from a 34 to a 49, so it's a big jump. Right there. Uh, are you excited to go to states? Hell yeah, I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, good luck at states. All right, thanks, bro. Are you always looking for something fun to do on the weekend? Well, you're in luck. Our drama team is putting on a production of Too Much Light Makes the Baby Go Blind this Friday, May 13th, and Saturday, May 14th. It's a quirky comedy that uses audience participation and has a lot of laughs. The show starts at 7 p.m. The cost is $10. However, you have an opportunity to get a discount by spinning a wheel and performing a task to drop the price to just $8. The yearbooks are in. Distribution day will be Monday, May 16th. Yearbooks will be distributed in room 522 through the lunches. There's a limited supply of extra yearbooks to purchase for each lunch period at $85, and it's on a first-come, first-served basis. No extra books will be sold before the distribution day. That's all we have for today, Gators. 
Tune in next week for another edition of Swamp Talk.